I dreamt about a song from one of our songbooks that we use at church that's called Was Gott tut, das ist wohlgetan, which translates to what God does is fully done. The song talks about how he will never deceive us, he has our best interests in mind and will always be here for us, whether he celebrates the good with us or comforts us through the bad. Where is life going that I had such a dream? Or was it just that? A dream. We were supposed to go to the kitchen basement at 8, but they called us 10 minutes earlier. Why, I don't know, but we'll see. Good morning and welcome back, or welcome if you are new to another video. We, today, we are making sausage. No, no, wait, let me do this again. Today is Valentine's Day, February 14, and we're making sausage. I think it's fitting because I really like sausage. We make sausage two times a year. We do it in November and then we also do it um, after after New Year sometime, usually February, March. -ish. This time around we don't make as much as we do in... We are only making four batches. Um, in November we made around eight, so it doesn't take as long. But anyways, we gotta go. Lunch break. Ooh. It's still over. at 11.15 and now with clean up it took us till um, 11.30 so it, it didn't take as long it doesn't take as long as it does in November because we make less um, winter sausage because it's called winter sausage for us is is it the winter thing and then once once we get around February March it starts to slow down a bit and there's always different things but anyways I'm gonna go home. The bell's gonna ring for lunch soon. It is now a little bit later and I'm done with my laundry. I decided to go for a little bit of a walk. It's beautiful outside. Pona is not with me this time. I think she went for a walk with somebody else because it took me to... Never mind! Where did you come from? I will sh say she startled me. I wonder if she saw me. She wasn't at the house when I wanted to go. Talk about her and she appears. I have no idea where she came from. But I do not mind having you. <laughs> Anyways, well now we got Coda. Go my light light. <laughs> oh wow. Oh my goodness. Oh my, oh my, wow. The tomato. <laughs> it doesn't feel that cold, honestly. It doesn't feel as cold as my face says it is. Because by looking at my face, I would say it, it, it feels like around minus 25 outside. I don't think it is.
Whatever it is, I'm not mad about it. to get Kona treats. Why would die? It is 5.03 and we are literally, we literally now just left Winnipeg. We got everything done that we had to do and it's also quite a drive home for us. It takes a while so you want to get in on time, you want to get home on time. Um, it's actually it's after 11 already there were th there were things that I wanted to do to want th th huh Wow that slipped my mind there were pillows and throws that I wanted to wash and I don't want to throw it along with my ro with my laundry because my laundry is big as in it as it is so I like to wash it separately but anyways I thought you would be interested in of course, of course, of course, of course, I had to go into a thrift store and I thought you would be interested in seeing what I found. I don't know any of these books. I just go by best-selling authors or uh, award-winning books. There is this one, Hotel on the Corner of Bitter and Sweet. Um, there's People of the Mist and no, I didn't pay four bucks for this book. I paid 50 cents for these books, which is amazing. Soul Mountain, so we'll see, see it has a, it won an award. And here's my favorite find. <laughs> yes, um, I found a set of Fancy Nancy books. There's four in here, or if not five. I like Fancy Nancy. We have a bunch of these in school, and why not? I mean, it's a. If I wanted to gift it to somebody, this would be perfect. I, excuse my lighting. What I'm now searching for are uh, German children's books. I guess my best bet would be online. If anybody knows of a good place where I can find um, German children's books, please let me know. Anyway, sorry if I rambled a little bit, but I just like talking to you and telling you things and updating you on things, showing you what I found in thrift stores, sharing my thoughts with you. <gasps> Look at that dust, oh my goodness. People are going to think I never clean my house. Quickly interrupting the cleaning because I know people who have seen the glasses and they're going to be wondering if I am actually wearing glasses and why they never see me with them. These are actually not real glasses, these are blue light glasses. The editing that I have to do, it was difficult on my eyes. I did quite a bit of research, some people believe that they work, others believe that they didn't and then I decided to just bite the bullet and try it out for myself. So I got this cheap two pack online and they actually work wonders. I really do notice a difference. You are better off vacuuming the couch or any piece of furniture and getting rid of as much dust as possible and then going in with a rag and getting the rest. It's really no big deal when you clean your house. It's just, we like to do it on Friday because on the weekend we like to have a clean house. I wanted to clean my my basement, my part of the house after my cook week, but I wasn't able to do it then. So now I missed two weeks in a row of cleaning it. So now it needs a thorough deep clean. So I'm starting on Wednesday, it's no big deal. But I will leave the washroom for tomorrow, for Thursday. And that is the cleaning process for this week. <laughs> Somebody 
asked me if I could give cleaning and laundry tips and tricks and here's one here's a big one I watch um, different people's YouTube videos and this is how I see them cleaning they are going in circles and walking into the parts of the floor that they have already cleaned and every time I see it I'm just like oh no please don't do that and now I'll show you the proper way of doing that because when you clean you're not supposed to be walking around in your already washed patches going up and down or going side to side with your mop and backing out of the room so that you don't walk into any of the already cleaned parts of the floor until they have dried now I'm not saying everybody does this this is just in case you do this um, here is a better way of doing it because you don't want to walk around in the patches that you have already washed almost done I only got the haul to do and actually I do everything twice you wash and then you dry <laughs> When I went to school, I took two art courses. I took art nine and art 10. And I did really enjoy drawing, but I know I'm not the best. And I thought, why not share these pictures with you? And it might be interesting to see these. <laughs> Just keep in mind that I am definitely not the best and I was definitely not the best. And also, this was in 2012, I was 15. The eyes and the curtains were part of them. I don't know, we had to draw about, I think it was maybe around six, seven simple pieces. So I um, actually have a dentist appointment today. I have to leave in 10 minutes and I have yet to get ready. It's really fruity. It's been a while. This is, I, um, you know, it's. I think it's about minus 20 outside, minus 30, and I'm eating um, frozen yogurt. I prefer all the fruity flavors. What did I get? Peach sorbet, kiwi, pineapple, and raspberry. When we do go to town, we can buy something to eat and drink that the colony pays for. And our choice today was tutti frutti, but not too expensive. I don't think anybody's going to go into a restaurant a while ago. Our community bought a whole bunch of little bubbles. We call them fish alley. Um, I am not for the the chocolate or the cheesecake. We have cheesecake. I wasn't feeling it's pretty it. Pretty good. Really? Like one of vanilla ice cream. Hi, honey. Kona's favorite place is right there by the door. There is actually cold air coming into our door. It's not properly sealed. And I think it has to do with her having an excessive amount of heat and liking the cold. Kona. Rest is only ever found in trusting the one who has everything figured out for your good and his glory. Because he is wise, gracious, faithful, and powerful, he is worthy of your trust and is alone able to give your heart rest. For further study and encouragement, Psalm 139. 